It's just another day at the Caleb's family farm. Workers strip tobacco, getting it ready for the market. But on Wednesday night, they worried it was all gone when a fire broke out at the farm. You're worried about it and you wonder what in the world's going on and the first thing that comes to your mind would be how could this accidentally start? Turns out it was no accident. Someone poured gasoline on tobacco bales and on a trailer, ruining several hundred pounds of tobacco. I'm out at least $2,000 and it could have been a lot worse. There's about 15,000 pounds of tobacco just in this barn. It's a family business that Michael Caleb's 91-year-old father worked hard to build. That's why it's hard to believe someone would try to take it all away. Well, I'm really hurt over it, and I can't imagine why anybody would want to do that here to this uh, family farm that's been in generations. We work hard, we employ a lot of people, and uh, we try to be pillars of the community. Laurel County Sheriff's deputies say no arrests have been made, but they do have persons of interest for the family they want to see justice. There's nothing to gain from it except a lot of heartache for other people, and, and I really hate that for that individual. But like any good farmer, Michael Caleb's and his crew continue to work. It's a setback, but as they put it, it could have been much worse.